Something I can assist with? Most satisfactory. <clears throat>
Devil in his hole, Thatch. This is a darling galley. Thirty-two guns, is it? I lost count of forty. You've stepped up a rung. So, any luck finding medicines here? Nothing round this spot, sadly. But there's a few wrecks yonder that have been scoured by nothing but crabs and coral. I'll have a look. Edward? Edward, is that you? My goodness, the West Indies is a compact place. Hello, Bonnet. A surprise seeing you out here? I met Mr. Thatcher a month or so ago, and he offered to take me under his yard arms, so to speak. Says I must wash the hayseed from my hair before I'm a true pirate. Well, good luck to you then. Worst men have become better under Blackbeard's watch.
Ahoy! Any luck? I found one crate hidden beneath a school of sharks. Sadly, the elixir inside is... quite spoilt. Plague and... perish. Will we steal medicines now? Remember the pardon, Thatch. We're to be subtle. Says Ornigold, a pirate, now too proud to call himself one. Now he prefers caution to cannons. Caution's nothing without charisma. Or if a man plays the fool, then it's only fools he'll persuade, but appear to be the devil. And all men will submit. And would you be the devil? Find a quiet way to acquire medicines. Tell me soon. Otherwise, I'll handle it myself. happened here? Were you attacked? Other way round. It were Blackbeard who struck first. Open fire on a British man of war, the pillock. What in God's name for? Still searching for medicines, but he's gonna bar me if you ask me. I'll bring him home. Leave him, man. He's heaped this trouble on himself.
Captain, there's a wreck yonder. Looks recent. I see it. Let's hope Thatch hasn't come to the same end. Another bit of wreckage, Captain. This is looking grim. Aye. Keep your eyes peeled. Blast. This is getting well out of hand. A dozen crates of medicine should not be so hard to come. That ain't my meaning. It's Thatch and Hornigold in this pointless feud of theirs. Can't you feel it? I do, I. But both men have their hearts in a good place. Both want the best for the people of Nassau. But is that the best cause for us? Saving a city that ain't worth much. We're not men made to govern. We take and spend and live heartily wherever we go. What solution would you propose? The answer's in wealth and power, not politics. If we found the observatory, We'd see enough money to buy the whole of England. Or it might be, we'd lord over these kings and emperors like they was passing themselves. A lot of large talk, Captain. But is it your crew you sail for, or yourself? I mean the best for these men, are they? I do. But this don't sit right. I'm a running errand, not living my life. Caution, Edward! The wind is picking up nasty! Trim the yards off the wind! Muzzle your tops, Mitrums! Of the wind, haul it all sail. Starts up with the will. Give me some speed. Let's ride this blow, lads. Ease her! Clue up! Clue up! Got you. 
Pull the mains! Reef those gallons! Ade, see that? It's her, Captain, the Queen Anne's Revenge. And she's in a bad way. No time for a vote. Thatch is outnumbered. The crew will understand. Beat the quarters, lads! We're sailing into hell! Stansos, let's ride this wall! All in the stunsel! Douse those gallons! All! All! All of it! Get off the wind! Bring it all, sir! Come and tight! Let out some sail! Get those bars free! Let's see that dock! Ease off the wind! All in all sail! Those are that dock, my trunks! That is overwhelmed. I'm going ashore. of trouble, Patch. In service of a noble car! Medicines, I hope you mean. Aye! A galleon nearby! And if we crack these quick, we might catch up to her! Hang in there, Bonnet! Keep your arms up and get back to the sea! Hold that. 
I'm not a man accustomed to murder, Captain. But if you'd taken quarter, you'd not be seeping now. Sack of muzzle, gobshite. You'll be hanged and sun-dried, just as them there were in Boston. The King's called for a pardon. <laughs> Captain, we've searched the hold. It's a middle intake. But the medicine we found bears a Charles Town stamp. Thank you, Mr. Hans. We cannot resupply Nassau out here by force and accident alone. We should go to Charlestown for the lot. Hello! Uh, are we victorious? I fear I am not built for the fatigue and care required to live as a man of fortune. Meet me in Charlestown. One month from today.